Sony is showing off a whole range of quite exciting and unusual smart home and smart lifestyle concept products. There are four concepts in total and each of them is designed to bring you information from your digital world completely hands-free without you having to do pretty much anything. I'm going to start off with the Xperia Ear because this is one of the concepts that actually is going to come to market later this year. It's basically a Bluetooth earpiece that will relay information from your phone such as incoming calls, incoming text messages, even things like the weather without you having to get your phone out and search for it. It's basically a personal assistant that lives right in your ear. Next up, the Xperia Agent. Now this sort of weird robot looking thing is designed to sit on your table at home, beaming down onto the surface, things like your calendar appointments, any incoming calls, maybe photos that you've shared. Basically all of your digital world is sort of spread out on the table so as you're leaving the house you can see what's going on and know what's coming up throughout the day. Now the Xperia projector, as the name suggests, also has a projector built in but also this thing will register your fingers and your hands in the air so you can actually use it as a digital touch screen. You can move the photos around, you can move the calendar appointments and basically interact with it as though it was a massive touch screen. And finally, we've got the Xperia Eye. Now, this is a small camera that you're designed to wear around your neck or clip onto your shirt, and it's basically taking photos continuously throughout the day, so you never have to miss a moment. It's got things like smile recognition, so if you're with some friends and it sees them smiling, then it will take the photos. As of right now, it's only the ear that's due to come to the market, but we should hopefully see these coming to life over the next couple of years. We will, of course, give you more information as we have it, so make sure to keep your eyes on CNET.com.